do a parenthetical? Don't, don't, don't sit down yet, but Trevor Matthews has moved his production company to L.A. And he's optioned one of the most extraordinary stories, Street Soldier. Even how many people here have seen The Departed? <laughs> Jack Nicholson character hires assassins and Trevor Matthews, Ottawa. Yeah. Producer, Steve McQueen, Canadian, Welsh heritage, has, to, has the script. He does, and it's unbelievable, you guys. Brook Street Films. Okay, go ahead. Here's what happened to me. And guys, I'm not altruistic. I'm not a saint. I did a reality show, an early reality show that I believed in in 2004 called Real, R-E-E-L. Ooh, get it? Uh, nightmares. <laughs> and what we did was we took all these nightmares from people all over North America, and the ones that were really sick, <laughs> we went and explored. So I would be, I, imagine me now in Toronto. And we've got, we, 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 we found somebody that has a really bad dream, okay, and, and they told us about it, right, and so now I'm walking down Bloor Street, and I turn off into an alley, and I walk down, and I'm beautifully lit from behind, looks like I have more hair than I do. And I'm walking down the alley in a really cool black suit with tight black jeans, and I hop over the back fence, and I walk into your yard, and knock on your door. You open the door and I say, hello, my name is Robert I didn't understand what they were saying. Then I went inside and they told me their nightmare. Now wait. Now I was like, full shrink. Very nice, very attentive. Hopefully my bald spots covered up. Now we, we love these people. We flew them back to LA. We spent a million dollars recreating it. <laughs> produced by the guy that produces Penn and Teller's bullshit. So mom. You know why we didn't why you never saw it? Because we couldn't get the legal clearance on this people. Because halfway through the scene where the kid is walking in knee-deep brown water in an underground canal with lots of sexual tubes and pipes about them. And there's a man following that grabs him from behind and realizes, oops, it's his stepfather. We can't get Clarence. So we I spent a year of my life doing this movie. Let me tell you guys, the girl from Alabama who had a clown fantasy, we put her in a 1910 mansion in downtown ghetto LA. Right? She knew she was. <laughs> we hired the Jim Rose Circus <laughs> as psycho clowns. That was her fear. She went into the bathroom to pee and get ready for work. And in the bathtub, under six or seven inches of what's the Swedish vampire movie? Help me. Let the right one in, vampire plasma. Sits up a Captain Howdy clown. <laughs> she opens the medicine cabinet. <laughs> a Jim Rose Circus Psycho. Heath Ledger clown. <laughs> this girl looked like Shelley Duvall. <laughs> it's everything you want in a reality show. <laughs> but we couldn't get those little things. I spent a year of my life on this show. This was what I thought reality television should be. Oh, call me stupid. Anyway, I thought I was good.